Your words and info make me feel like there is indeed good in the world, despite all the local flip-flop we hear in and around Regina of how crappy EVs are and how solar will never work. Lately, I seem to find myself tense and angry after setting people straight on Facebook about EV information, getting yelled at with more misinformation, and then unfollowing old friends. More and more, I can take a deep breath, turn on a clean energy show episode, and instantly feel justified in all those stats I can never remember. Just we're at a certain kind of inflection point where maybe when we started this podcast four years ago, it was just rampant on places like YouTube, social media, that climate change is not real and false information about that. They do note in the article that it's the effects of climate change are becoming too real. They're hard to ignore. I mean, for us, we had a smoky summer yeah. every damn day last year, but it's, it's wrong. And one Tesla breaks down, it's a national news story. Do you know how many bloody yeah. ice cars, <laughs> gas and diesel that I've passed that have broken down? Not on the national news. It was the nonprofit center for countering digital hate that did this study. They monitor all of these, you know, YouTube channels and social media for misinformation, and that's how they track it. Uh, I, I, it's depressing. It's, uh, it's disheartening. It's, it's hard to deal with. It's, it's, it's a virus that can't be stopped. It's just, I, you put out one fire, it starts on another. Like it's just, it's whack-a-mole. It's just constant crap.